Hello guys, Fred here from Pro Tennis Trader. I hope you're well. In this video, I'm going to explain probability and expected value, two concepts that should be fully understood by any successful trader. Now, betting, gambling, and trading have been around for centuries, and probability is an essential concept that every better or trader must understand to increase their chances of winning, or at least profiting, over the long term. Now, in simple terms, probability is the likelihood of a particular outcome occurring in an event. Now, as I'm a trader, I'll focus this video on probability in trading rather than betting, but of course, the same principles apply. So in trading, the probability of an outcome determines the odds assigned to it, and understanding these odds is critical to successful trading. Now, in sports trading, the odds of an event are usually expressed in fractional or decimal formats. For example, if a bookmaker offers odds of 2 to 1 for a particular team to win a match, it means that the probability of that team winning is one third or 33.33%. Similarly, if the odds offered are 3.0, it means that the probability of that outcome occurring is also 33.33%. Now, of course, in essence, the lower the odds, the higher the probability of the outcome occurring. So to calculate the probability of an event, you simply divide the number of ways that event can occur by the total number of possible outcomes. For example, in the coin toss, there are two possible outcomes, heads or tails. Therefore, the probability of getting heads is one to two or 50%. Now in sports trading, the probability of an outcome is calculated based on the strength of the teams or players involved, their recent form, injuries, and other factors. So in trading, it's essential to understand the concept of expected value. This is a measure of the potential return on investment for a particular trade or bet. It's calculated by multiplying the probability of an event occurring by the amount that will be won if that event occurs, and then subtracting the probability of that event not occurring multiplied by the amount that will be lost if it doesn't occur. In essence, if the expected value is positive, it means that the bet is a good one. And if it's negative, it's not. So let's look at an example. So let's say the odds of a particular player winning a tennis match are 2.50, and you decide to place a simple bet of £10 on them to win. Now the potential return on investment is £25. This is calculated by multiplying the stake by the odds. Now, if the probability of that player winning is 40%, the expected value of the bet is the following. 0.4 times £25 minus 0.6 times £10 equals £10 minus £6. And this equals £4. Now, since the expected value is positive, it means that the bet has a positive expected return and it's a good bet or trade to make. However, if the expected value is negative, it means that the bet is not worth making and it's likely to result in a loss. Now, of course, it's important to note that probability is not an exact science and even the best bettors and traders can experience losing streaks. However, understanding probability and using it to inform your betting and trading decisions can increase your chances of profiting over the long term. Now, it's also essential to manage your bankroll effectively and not to bet or trade more than you can afford to lose. So in conclusion, probability is a critical concept in both betting and trading. It determines the odds assigned to outcomes and understanding these odds can help traders make informed decisions. By calculating the expected value of a bet or trade and managing your bankroll effectively, you can increase your chance of winning and, of course, minimising your losses. However, betting and trading should always be done responsibly, and it's important to remember that there is no such thing as a sure thing in any one-off bet or trade. Now, if you found this video useful, then please do check out my YouTube channel for loads more videos and subscribe to be notified of when I upload new videos. And if you'd like to become a successful tennis trader, then you can start your journey by enrolling on my free video course, An Introduction into Tennis Trading at ProTennisTrader.com.
www.tennistrading.com. And you can also grab a free copy of my ebook, Tennis Trading, The Ultimate Guide to Getting Started. I'll see you soon.